Hey Tyler, Theater Design Company. So Tech Tuesday, week number two. And full disclaimer again, we're using some recycled video for these first couple Tech Tuesdays. What we need from you is to uh, not only subscribe, but we want some comments below on what you'd like to see on a tech-based type video, uh, whether it's cutting a speaker in, uh, building a uh, false wall, um, using a certain tool. We're happy to uh, make a video on it. All right, so go ahead and take a look at this video. Again, with some recycled content with a super cool time lapse at the end. And uh, week number three, we got some cool stuff coming up for the Tech Tuesday. Thanks a lot. I've laid out a few of our uh, items we use for the fabric track system. Uh, first and foremost, um, Guilford of Maine fabric. So you can see we have just a, a million samples here. Um, these are all from various projects. These laid out are all the samples we tried for this room to get the color right. And what we decided, let's jump back here to some of the fabric tracks. So you can see here we're using uh, two different things here. We've got a perimeter um, square edge, and then we've got a perimeter, um, or excuse me, we have a mid wall um, non beveled for the center. And that'll give us an element of five panels and will create a seam. And uh, here you can see different uh, bevels. So here's a perimeter beveled edge. And again, I'm getting this camera sorted out with the light, so I apologize, but I think it's gonna make uh, some better videos when we're done here. So this has a beveled edge. We're obviously doing a square edge, which is this one, so this is a perimeter square. And then on our case, we're doing a mid wall square. So it's got just a, a nice seam. It gives you about a 16th to an eighth inch seam down the middle, giving it a nice shadow line and effect. And then if you really wanted to get a little more aggressive, here's a mid-wall bevel. Let's see if I can zoom in on that, but it's got a beveled edge. These are uh, test pieces. This is from Kinetic Noise Control. That's our go-to uh, company for fabric track systems. Again, Guilford of Main Fabric. And then a few of the tools we use for fabric systems. So we'll get a couple of tools here. Little edge. And then you need the little scissors to do this. So we'll get those sharpened a couple times a year. And then a couple of quick things to go over, and then I'll get into doing the uh, time lapse of me doing one fabric wall. Um, here's some of the fabric uh, acoustical panel. So we put these beneath the uh, kinetic noise. So you've got one inch track. Um, it's actually an inch and an eighth, and most of the material we're using is one inch. So we have a TAD diffusion panel. And as you can see on those, those are one inch thick with a hard face with the holes in it so it's kind of a kind of a mixture of a diffusion and an absor absorption panel and then we use an off three and six pound uh, insulation board for the rest of our areas and then you can kind of see just right in here we've got some uh, kinetic noise stealth diffusers and that's for the back wall here so we got a four foot by a nearly four foot diffusion panel on the back wall which is always a nice feature you'll see a lot of theaters that'll have diffusions um, or this Guilford of Maine fabric and when we order these these are what we order for customer for swatches so if you're doing a fabric wall system with us we end up ordering these you can see all the colors and matter of fact jump into this one here this is what our front screen wall will be um, it's the anchorage and uh, we use an onyx that's midnight and this bag here is the onyx color which you can also do their deep black color a lot of guys like the uh, anchorage and the burgundy and then you can get into some textures here which are pretty neat even some metallics and if you want to go plain you've got anchorage again white these are a lot of typical fabric colors as you can see these are all just samples from customers even one we thought we might be doing some green a tweed so again, tons of colors for all this. Thank you.